the United States Army has submitted a request to Congress for the allocation of $3.1 billion to expand the production of shells of 155mm caliber. Assistant Secretary of the Army for Acquisition, Logistics and Technology, Doug Bush, made the announcement, noting that the funding will help expand manufacturing capacity, strengthen the American economy and create new jobs. About half of the amount is planned to be spent on the development of production capabilities, and the rest, on the purchase of ammunition. The United States plans to upgrade or build industrial facilities for the production of 155mm shells in various states, including Virginia, California, Tennessee, and Texas. According to Bush, this decision is part of a funding package that the administration of President Joe Biden has already submitted to Congress. As part of this plan, the U.S. plans to increase the monthly production of artillery shells to 100,000 by 2025. In addition, the U.S. executive is considering the possibility of financing the production of other types of weapons, such as increasing the annual production of anti-aircraft missiles for the Patriot system from 500 to more than 600 units. It should also be noted that the U.S. Air Force delivered a batch of M-795 artillery shells to Israel at the end of October.